What's going on guys, ADT here. Today we're looking at the Book of Chances from Andrew Wong and Scott Cares. They made this deck of cards that's musical. I received this as a gift very lovingly and we're gonna check it out today. Let's, let's open it up. deck inside. Ooh, I like the dice. It's the same thing we saw on the outside. Slice and dice. Ready save. Minor second chord. Two of diamonds. A sharp over B flat down there. I think that's rhythm at the bottom but I don't know. Let's try and get this a little You see that? It's rainbowy. Cards are like holographic or something. It's really cool. We made it in. Let's do it. Okay. There's a lot. It must be a full deck, right? Yeah, it's a full deck you can play with. Okay. I'm gonna look through a couple of these. So we got the slicing dice first. Minor second. Slicing dice. Reverse it? Is this just like. What key we're in, I'm guessing. What chord we're gonna use. Major minor. That's cool. I love these pictures. They're really cool. Yeah. This is a different one if you combine those rhythms. So yeah, there's ideas for rhythm on here. There's key ideas. There's even chordal ideas. Lyrics potentially. I think it's super cool. There's a lot of opportunity here for creative, uh, creative help. If you're in a writing, a writing block, that's a rest. That's not even a, that's not even a key. O's and pluses. I don't know what it means. So like this is a six add something. And we've got a quarter rhythmic note. I'm excited to look online to see what they say about different ways to use this upside down. They smell really interesting. Not in a bad way. Okay, I'm gonna draw four cards and we're gonna use them for a quick song idea, chord progression. So we got silence, we got share a secret, slice and dice, reverse it. Okay, let's see what we can do. I've kind of played it out here. I've just, we've gone through Major, minor, minor, major. We're gonna go with just the notes in the bottom as the, the root of that chord. Um, and then I'm using the Roman numerals as kind of like a seventh chord, a sixth chord, use the second. That's our progression there. And I'm not gonna do the rhythmic stuff at the moment. I'm just trying to kind of play with this. going in order the way that I drew the cards but I mean I could shift them around too and I could try and do something else I mean be creative right I can't wait to try to make a, a whole song out of this I mean um, I'm not sure about this progression in particular but I think it's a really cool idea and I would have never came up with this progression myself and I do think it's cool but maybe it would be a really good challenge to try and just make something out of it anyway I think it's really cool. It's a great idea. ADT from the editing booth here. If you're enjoying this video, hitting the like button goes a long way to support this channel and is super appreciated. Now back to the cards. I mean, yeah, endless possibilities really. Thanks Andrew and Scott for this amazing card deck. I'm gonna be using this all the time I'm gonna absolutely make some like videos Showcasing this more because this is like such a great tool for musicians And I know it's great to have something like this to just you know break you out of that that hunch So thanks guys <laughs> 